What's going on everybody? I've got friends and neighbors asking me, hey, how do I start this crypto thing? How do I get into this space? Well guys, I'm gonna show you. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to sign up for pro.coinbase.com, which is the exchange I use, possibly the biggest trusted exchange in the US. I'm gonna show you how to deposit money with Coinbase. I'm gonna show you how to withdraw money from Coinbase. And I'm also gonna show you guys how to place orders. So literally everything you guys wanna know about Coinbase, you're gonna learn in this video. So let's go. First things first, you guys need to go to pro.coinbase.com. All right, you're gonna see this and it's gonna say get started. Click that bad boy and let's get started. So you guys need to fill out your first name, you need to fill out your last name, email address, password, select your state, and then verify that you are in fact over 18 years of age. If you meet all that criteria, click create an account. Quick side note, if you guys are in the US and you're like, okay, I love Coinbase, that's awesome, but it doesn't have all the coins that I really wanna trade, Binance.us is an awesome option for you guys. Go to Binance.us, click get started, follow the same procedure I'm gonna show you guys on Coinbase here. Email, password, referral ID if you have one, make sure you're 18 years of age or older, and then click create an account. Okay, here's something I want you guys to know about, is that sometimes when you create an account on Coinbase or Binance.us, they're gonna ask for a verification of identity. Now, usually they just ask for an upload of your driver's license, and sometimes they ask you guys for a verification of your address. So that can be like a PG&E bill or a water bill or something like that. It is safe, I've done this, millions of people have done this. Don't feel like, oh my gosh, they're gonna take my money and run or my identity. No, they do this to protect you and they do it to protect themselves. So it's a two-way street, everyone stays protected, all right? So let's go back to the homepage here. While this loads, um, I wanna show you guys the app. So take your eyes over to the left side of your screen. We're gonna do app download time, all right? And I'm gonna wait for that to load. What you guys are gonna do is come into your you know, Android, iOS, doesn't matter. Type in Coinbase Pro, all right? Coinbase Pro, uh, P-R-O, and then click enter. All right, at the top here, you guys see Coinbase. Now this is the actual um, Coinbase.com app. I do not trade on Coinbase.com. The fees are higher, the user interface is terrible compared to pro.coinbase.com. Pro.coinbase.com is where you trade. This is where the big boys, this is where the retail traders get in, they get out, this is where they trade, okay? What I want you guys to do is come down to the Coinbase Pro with the black icon, all right? It's this one right here, you guys can see it. Let's not waste time, let's get into it. Download it, open it. Pause the video if you need to, get to this step, get it on your phone. I'm gonna go through all the steps here. This is where I show you guys how to deposit, how to withdraw, um, and how to actually place orders and, and all that fun stuff, okay? So, first thing you're gonna be presented with is this front screen and it shows you all of the currencies, all right? If you're like, hey, I don't know if there's enough currencies to trade on here, I'm like, Seriously? <laughs> Sorry, it's a little bit of a joke. If you wanna trade coins like VeChain and some other ones, I understand they're not on here. You guys can go to Binance.us, sign up on there, and it'll totally work. If you're like, man, I don't know if I'm gonna make enough money trading you know, these coins on... on um, Sorry, I got a notification coming through. By the way, that's from Crypto Panic. If you guys want a great news source for iOS, for crypto, Crypto Panic. Great. So if you guys are like, I don't know if I'm gonna make enough money. Well, hey, take a look at this one. This one's up 10% in the last 24 hours, Litecoin. So yeah, you can make some pretty good money. I've made really, really good money just trading the coins on here. So let's walk through one of these. Bitcoin.us. First, you're gonna present it with the price and a little bit of a chart. Basically tells you, you know, what the chart's doing. Top right up here, you can be able to click 15 minutes. You can go to six hours. Just shows you like per candle, it's that duration, so six hours. Go to the depth, buyers versus sellers. Go to the book, awesome, all right? Down here under orders, you're gonna see your filled orders. So these are orders that you have already placed and hey, they've gone through and you've either made money because you sold or you're currently in a trade. So this is a market sell you guys can see down here. All right, now let's go back to the front page and go to the second spot. This is gonna show you guys my current portfolio and where the positions are. So it's gonna show your default portfolio of how much you have in there. I'm currently down 20 bucks. And then you guys are gonna be able to see your available balance and then your on orders, okay? Deposit and withdrawal, which I'm gonna go over in a second. And then this shows your allocation. So I have, at Looking at this, $4,199 in, in USD that I have ready to go into trades. Cardano, I own 21%, EOS I own 21, and the Graph I own 14%. Awesome, you guys can click into these and you guys can either deposit or withdraw. All right, like I promised you, I showed you guys how to, uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to deposit and withdraw. Click on US, all right? So you guys see how I did that? I clicked on US here and go to deposit. So what you guys can do is you guys can do a bank account uh, deposit. Now I might blur some stuff out on here just to make sure I keep my details private, but 
All you have to do is come in and set up an account and then you can start transferring over. So your question is, well, I don't know how to do that. Don't worry, I'm gonna show you right now. Go to the far bottom right where it shows the little icon of a face and the dude you know, sitting there and then you guys are gonna see this screen. You're gonna see my two accounts here, which is my Chase accounts. What you do is you do click add a payment method and then do bank account and then this is where you guys can connect. Wells Fargo, Chase. Uh, I don't know, whatever you guys have, it doesn't matter. You do this, you click continue. It'll have you, for me, it had me logging with my uh, username and password. I chose the account and I was set up. Like literally this took me like 10 to 15 seconds. It's not hard at all. So this finishes the video of how do you deposit? There you go. That's how you deposit. Possibly the coolest thing about Coinbase is they have what's called instant fund settlement. So you can transfer up to gosh, I don't know. I've done up to $5,000, but I'm sure, I know you can do more where the funds automatically go into Coinbase so you guys can start trading it. It's so sweet. All right, so that's how you deposit, okay? Coming back over, let's quickly go over how to withdraw because everyone's like, I just... I know how to get money in, but are they gonna take my money and run? <laughs> no, that's on the sketchy exchanges. Stay away from those, all right? So how do you withdraw? Simply come over here to the US dollar and then click withdraw. That's all you're gonna do. And then you go to bank account. And then you're gonna choose your bank account that you set up to put money in for deposit is the same one you can choose to send money out. Why can't I do anything right now? Because I don't have any money in USD. The USD that you see in here is all of the money that is currently on orders. Okay, so I don't have any US dollars that I can just come out and <laughs> Elon Musk just sent a tweet. <laughs> um, I don't have any money that I can actually send out because they're all on orders. This is how you deposit and this is how you withdraw. All right, last part of the video, you guys are like, well, hey, how do I actually place orders? Well, I'm gonna show you that in a second, but let's go over to the orders tab first so you understand this. Open orders. So you guys are gonna see all the orders. Once you place a buy limit, um, a sell limit, you're gonna see it here. Market orders, you're gonna see here as well. Open orders are orders that have not yet been executed, okay? As you scroll down, you're gonna see this little gray tab that says filled orders. These are orders that have gone through on the exchange and they are filled, they're done forever. You can't get rid of them because you either bought or you sold, okay? This is a full history of what you guys have done. Obviously, I do a lot of trading, so there's a lot in there. So how do you actually place orders? And if you guys are following me on the YouTube channel, I only use buy limits and I only use sell limits. Why? Because it kind of automatically fulfills the theory of buy low, sell high. You can't do a buy limit unless you know you're below the current price. You can't do a sell limit unless you're above the current price, so it's kind of cool. All right, so here's how you do that. Click into anything. Um, I am not gonna be able to execute a trade here because I have all my funds on there, but follow me here, you'll get it. It's really simple. Let's say you wanna trade Bitcoin, all right? And you wanna get in here and the price is currently sitting at 38,722. And you're like, you know what? At 38,000 flat, I wanna go in and put a market order, excuse me, um, a buy limit. Buy limit basically means you wanna get underneath the price the current price. Take the current price and you wanna buy in lower than that. That's a buy limit. Current price and you wanna sell higher than that, that's a sell limit. Watch this. Come over here and click buy. I don't have any money. <laughs> okay, well, what am I gonna do here? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna place uh, a trade with you guys, a live one. I'm gonna take one of mine off. So uh, let's do ADA for example, and I did this at 50 cents as a buy limit. Cool. I'm gonna write this down so I don't forget this. So you guys will actually see me place a live trade on here. Kind of cool, right? Um, maybe it's a, a little bit better I did this so you guys can get a little more practice. All right, Cardano, ADA, let's go over here. So I wanna buy this, a buy limit at 50 cents. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna click buy. Sorry if my mic has got a little quieter there. I'm trying to talk into it over here. So what you guys are gonna do is you're gonna click buy. Now you're gonna see this screen come up. You have three options, limit, market, and stop. I never use stop, I only use limit, and I only use market. Market orders are gonna get you in at the exact current price immediately, pronto, okay? I don't use these because to me, it's honestly like pulling the slot machine. You get excited and you're like, oh, pull the slot machine. I got my emotions high. I don't do that. So what I like to do is come over here and I like to click limit. I only use buy limits like I told you guys. For this one, we're gonna say it's at $1.72 and I wanna get in and buy at 50 cents in case it drops really fast and it goes really, really low. I wanna be picked up. Your limit price, come over here, but 0 0.50. And then the amount, you can now choose, which I love this about Coinbase, I love this so much. This is going to take your cash allocation and split it up into percentages. Do you wanna use 25, 50, 75, or max of your cash on hand? For this example, I wanna use max. So I'm gonna stick $1,000 in at 50 cents for Cardano, and it shows you your fees and your total. Click preview order. 
Awesome. It says limit price, it says the amount, it says the expiration, it says the uh, execution and the total. I'm gonna click place by order. Awesome, now you see it showed up down here under open orders, but where else, this is the test, where else did it show up? I just went over this. If you guys go back to the home screen and you go three tabs over on the bottom, there you go, it just popped up. It says ADA USD for 50 cents. Awesome. All right, now let me show you guys how to do a sell limit. And I'm gonna get rid of one of these because um, I think you guys just deserve to see me do this with live money in here. Okay, I'm gonna write this down. EOS, so I'm gonna get rid of EOS and this is at $7.50. So let's get rid of this, let's cancel this order and go do a sell limit. All right, so let's go search for EOS. So EOS, oops, EOS. And then you guys can do USD. Um, this is quite obvious, but this is um, USD. You guys actually can trade, let me show you this real quick. I'm not getting off tangent, this is good. You guys see how it's everything's paired to the US dollar right here? If you guys keep scrolling down, there um, is USDC you guys can trade and then you can also trade against BTC down here. Um, and then if you guys go all the way down to the bottom, you guys can trade against uh, GBP and EUR, stuff like that. I only trade USD because that's, that's what I trade in and that's what I make money in. So that's what I like depositing and withdrawing in is stuff I can actually use. All right, let's go to EOS. Um, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a sell limit. So come up here to search and click EOS and then you guys can click um, USD. All right, same thing, but we are gonna sell this time. So click sell and then the uh, limit price I had was 750. So come up here and do 750. Again, the amount, I'm gonna do max. I'm gonna sell $2,600 of EOS at 750. The fee is $9.19 and the total is 2,616. So, um, sorry for all those notifications. I've, Elon Musk is tweeting away this morning. <laughs> so what you're gonna do is click preview order. Once you guys click preview order, you're gonna see another Elon Musk tweet. You're gonna see uh, the limit price in here, which is 750, and then the amount is 350, and then expiration and execution, okay? And then all you guys have to do here is click place sell order. That is it, guys. There's nothing else to it. This is literally a full walkthrough of how to trade, and this is exactly what I do. Um, the only other thing I'll show you in here, which really doesn't have anything to do with the app, it's really just tradingview.com. If you guys don't know about tradingview.com, it's the best charting software in the world. You can get it for free. I actually use the free version. I know you guys might be like, oh, I use the highest version because I teach YouTube. I use the free version. I don't pay anything for this. So this is what I use to call the trades out on the YouTube channel, but I suggest you guys use tradingview.com. It is incredible. This is where I mock up my trades. And then obviously the um, Coinbase Pro app is where I trade. You can also go into pro.coinbase.com, open the exchange there and do the exact same thing I just showed you for buy limits and sell, uh, buy limits and sell limits and market orders if you want and place it there. But I like to do the app and that's what, um, that's what I do to trade. So trying to think real quick, is there anything else I wanna show you guys? I don't think so. I think that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, that's a full overview. You guys are literally now ready to trade and go. <laughs> Text from my mom, so sweet. <laughs> All right, guys, God bless you. I hope you had an amazing time uh, watching this video and I hope you guys learned a lot. You're ready to trade. Feel free to follow me on YouTube at uh, youtube.com backslash, let me get this up here, sorry so much. <laughs> These are the videos I just headed up. You can follow me on YouTube at Trade Confident. I call out a bunch of trades here and I do use uh, the Coinbase app to trade and you guys will see all the trades that I'm taking on here and I think you guys are really gonna like it. So there you guys go. Have fun, like, subscribe, and I'll keep these awesome videos coming. See you guys, bye-bye.